and I just need my Bible and the good word of God. your girl the plush mommy I am plush and I'm a mommy that is why I have that name and it's another try on haul plus size dress edition from my favorite spot affordable spot boohoo I really have no reason other than the fact that it was time to get some dresses so we're gonna do a little bit of a dress haul. We're gonna do some modest dresses for my modest ladies of the Lord. And we're also gonna do some scandalous dresses. We can see the thigh meets child and the body parts. You heard it, eh! So, before we get started, you already know what to do. Please make sure that you hit the thumbs up on this video, like it now. You do, you like it, you like me. I know you like me. I don't want to hear anything else. You like me. And also hit subscribe, okay, so that you can get notified for all of my awesome videos. This is how you dance. <laughs> and of course, if you're new to this channel, thank you guys for coming. I really hope that you stick around. Subscribe, subscribe, and subscribe. Thank you. Let's get started. First up, Sister Odell's dress from 2012. I don't know. Listen, let's talk about it. I don't know the names of the dresses. Everything I bought, again, 3X, still the same body. Nothing new here, whatever. We're not gonna talk about it. Actually, no, this was a size 26. It is actually, it fits perfectly. It big in some areas, but for me, it's fine. Um, on the model, it looked sexy, you know, cause she had everything right. But for me, it's not. It's a midi length, M-I-D-I, so it goes right here in the mid calf. And honestly, zhuzh it up with the pumps. Ow. Oh God, oh, oh. Ah! My! <laughs> so yeah, you wear the heels. Yeah, I would definitely wear this with like, you know, <laughs> that really hurt. Sensible clutch and the pumps, right? And your Bible, because this outfit needs a Bible. I don't know why. Um, it has this, I don't know what this is, but it's itchy. So I, it's the same material, crinoline. It feels like the crinoline under your dress from when you were eight at that damn wedding that you were a flower girl in, but you had to wear that itchy dress and you were just like this all the time. That's what it feels like. Um, I know this isn't crinoline, but it feels like it. I wanna say it's tulle, but it has an over layer for the top part of it. It's like an A-line empire waist kind of cut and it's a pencil skirt dress and it has this crinoline over layer. I'm pretty sure once it's washed and steamed, this will be fine, but I am, <laughs> I am itchy. I am itchy in it. Other than that, I think it's very cute. I think it's very perfect for Easter Sunday, okay? If you want that Bible study Zoom chic, this is the dress for you, okay? If you want the bridal shower, the modest bridal shower with grandma and aunties, this is the dress for you. Um, in my lifestyle, and the way I live my life, and just how I operate, this is actually the dress for me. I know I'm making a lot of jokes right now, but it is a dress for me just because of where I be going and stuff. Like, I kind of need to be modest. A lot of times, I am a mommy, so I don't like having my thigh meets out unnecessarily for no purpose other than to just have them out. Like, I'm, I'm not, everything is like a woman's movement. You know, sometimes I just want to have everything covered up and looking elegant anyway. So I like it, I like it for the color. It does come in black. I didn't like it in black and I have way too many black clothes. So I got this instead and I love it. And it's comfortable, aside from this itchy feeling, it's, it's very comfortable. The itchy thing though, honestly you can get that fixed in no time. I think for me, I'm just, I'm not used to wearing clothes because I've been home all the time. So maybe that's probably what's happening, but that's where I'm at. So anyway. 
that's what this is. This is the back. And it's very, it's very nice. Very elegant and it can be clothes fitting. I sized up a great deal for this, so I would suggest just wearing, it probably runs to like two size. So I would suggest sizing to your size. And I do have on shapewear with this, so what you see is what you get, okay? Don't get too excited. It does come with a stretchy, and it, the belt doesn't have to be on. I just put the belt like this. And the skirt is a stretchy material too. So you do have options, all right? Next one. So... I know you think I'm going to bed. I'm not going to bed. This is actually a dress. I know you think I'm supposed to wear pants with this. No, it's a shirt dress and I like it. All right. This little ditty from the Boohoo's is a um, shirt dress. I actually got, I believe three of them. I really like shirt dresses. And for a busty girl, it is incredibly difficult to find proper fitting shirt dresses. And this was no different. Um, but actually I do like the fit of this one. It does come really big because I did size up a great deal again um, so that I could get the exact fit I wanted for this dress. Um, the only thing about it, aside from the fact that I can't seem to button the, <laughs> the damn sleeve myself, is it does look very much like I'm going to sleep. I would probably need to belt this and put some tights just because I am well endowed in the backside area. And so it does lift up a lot on the sides. The back is fine. It covers the back the exact amount I needed to cover so that I'm not, you know, struggling to bend over or pick up things that I drop, whatever. It does go above the knees. Not so scandalous for me. I'm not like, oh my God, it's above the knees. Burn me to at the stake. I'm not that person. Um, it's buttoned down all the way, but you can really just keep it buttoned and then pull it over your head the whole time. Like you don't have to struggle with the buttons like I did. Um, however, what will happen right here, that right there. So don't take this dress to a football game. Don't take this dress to a soccer game and wear it without some types of shorts or pants because... Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. It's just going to have a lot of thigh meats. You don't want that. And you're going to be doing this move all, you know, the entire time. So it's not exactly the most fun. But it does look like I'm going to sleep, right? It looks, It's very soft and sateen. Um, that's what the fabric is. And, of course, it is leopard print, which I love leopard print. That's, like, one of my favorite prints um, to wear. Again! cute red lip with some heels and a clutch and you're out here for the night i think my biggest setback with this obviously and we all know this move here <laughs> we're all aware of what happens all of us busty girls we know what this is we know this we know this problem so that's another issue so this the cut of it doesn't seem to really suit my proportions um the way i need them to right but for me outside of that it's not too too terrible it's just I'm probably gonna need to do some tights with it just to make it wearable. Bars, it's not too terrible. I can wear some tights to make it wearable. <laughs> so you guys tell me in the comments what you think about this one, but it is still a dress, okay? That's what they said it was, all right, in the, on the website. They said it was a dress. So it's still a dress, it's just a short dress. It's a short shirt dress. Don't want no short, short, oh actually not short, she didn't say short the second time, she said another word, but this is a family channel. Next one. Okay, so look here, it's a frock, it's just, it's not, it's not whatever. Um, It wouldn't be me if I didn't get a maxi dress. And I am all about the maxi dress. I feel like it's not gonna be so drapey and long after it goes through a wash. I just, in my heart, I've had I've had my hopes up before. You get a cheap, thin, material maxi dress that goes down to the ankles just so, you know, and it feels like it's just the perfect maxi dress. 
you wash it a couple times and then suddenly this beautiful flow feeling that you have right now suddenly turns into this. And now you're really upset, right? I don't want that. But either way, this is a Boohoo maxi dress. Very self-explanatory. It's one of those types of maxi dresses that require some zhuzh. Um, but it's really great for... It's kind of like the mom uniform, right? When you want to get up, get your errands running, you throw this one on, all right? You throw on your ponytail wig, and you get out the door, and you get it moving. And you just put your flip-flops on. This is a really great beach dress. It's a really great airy dress. It's super thin. I don't recommend, like, thongs. <laughs> well, I mean, obviously, I do recommend thongs. I'm sorry. I don't recommend a lot of underwear um, for this one. I recommend letting it breathe. Um, <laughs> and it's, it's super stretch flow flow it kind it is a little form fitting for your shape so that's really helpful so whatever shape you have the dress will find it and i think that's needed to be said um but yeah you, you could definitely just do a long necklace some cute earrings um a satchel purse and you walk out the door looking like a million bucks it's a dress up dress down type of dress so not a lot to say about it i got it just because I'm running low on maxi dresses. Don't judge me. I know you see all these hauls and you're like, how is she running low on any clothes? I am. Thanks. So I went and I needed, I got this one. Because I just wanted something very simple, different color than I'm not used to, and it's green. Um, it does come in multiple colors. It's one of those very multiple colors dress. I would absolutely do sneakers with this. Um, just because I am who I am, I would probably wear sneakers with this. And or flip flops with this. I'm um, one of the two. I'm definitely one of the two. But I um, can't say much else. It's really comfortable. Gotta say, super comfortable. Love it very much. Definitely recommend it for you guys and gals who like to do comfortable dresses. Next one. Okay. So, yikes. Yes. Just makes you smile. Does it just make you smile? <laughs> this is the shortest dress I've bought. I think of all of the dresses, this one would be the shortest one. Super cute, very spring, summertime, fun. It's very summer loving, you know, hi. Just like, wanna do this right now? Um, <laughs> I would need to probably get a safety pin for this area just cause of me, or just different bra, really. Um, probably a lower cut bra, just to shape out the boob situation, but very cute, very spacious and airy. Even though it's long sleeve, I don't see myself getting too hot um, in it, so that's super cool. It comes with the string. It's not a wrap dress, it's just, it looks like it has a wrap. A low cut um, skater, I believe, skater dress. It comes with this like frilly, you can tie your, your sleeves to kind of cuff the sleeve to make it a little frilly girliest dress ever it's super cute flun and flirty um i just feel flirty and 30 and fine i just love how cute and fun it is i love the flowers and the airy feeling i do know that when it gets windy that's a problem because it's so short and that's the back so i know that the wind goes Woo! and then i'm like you know you know that move <laughs> I'm gonna have to do that a lot but um, definitely wouldn't wear these with heels I'm a tall girl so healing this is not something that's in the cards for me just because I don't want to look like a lady of the night that's just me that's just me that's just me you don't gotta be that girl no one's telling you to be that girl I'm just gonna say I don't want to be a lady of the night I want to also implore you to put shorts on under this um, and then maybe have bigger boobs <laughs> or just a different bra, you know, because a balconette bra might not be the good fit for this. So a lower cut, deeper cut bra so that, you know, you can cover how you need to. Um, but it's not too bad. And I really enjoy it for my shape. I enjoy it for my body. And whatever stage my body is in, this is a really good cut that fits me so i'm a fan i'm a huge fan of it and i really do like that 
You let me know in the comments how you feel. I just feel like, you know, holding hands outside on the boardwalk, you know, eating ice cream. Just reminiscing of the good old days when there wasn't a fatal pandemic outside killing everyone and all of that. Right? Good times. Next one. So does it look like I got left off of bad and bougie though? <laughs> can't even. Listen, I'm gonna put it up in the side so you can know. I actually am a huge fan of Versace-esque prints. I know it's not a thing for a lot of people because it's so busy. I love them. And I know I look like your grandmother's couch right now. I get it. You don't gotta tell me. But I love this. I know I look like a member of Migos. Totally fine. Not, 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 not your cup of tea. We don't gotta go there. It's okay. Am I? Do I look like a Ricky Martin fan? Maybe. But I still love it. And it's okay. It's so cute though, right? <laughs> Just, ah. It's another shirt dress. Same problem as before. So, boing, all that thigh meat, but it's really long in the back. So if you're not as, I mean, this is when little booties do matter because then having a little booty, this will actually fit like the shirt dresses should fit, right? But if you have a lot of body and a lot of parts, you might need to put some tights on, depending on your level of risk, hey, you know, I, I can't dictate that for you. Only you can. Yes. Do I look like... Who was it that was left off of Bad and Bougie? Was it Quavo? Offset? I forgot the third one. <laughs> God damn it. Jeez. And if, if, if it's the third one that I forgot that was left off, that would be totally fine. Yes, it is extremely shiny. And um, I did have a romper with a similar pattern that I wore to Trinidad. And same thing, but you know what? You only live once, YOLO, okay? I'm okay with it. So um, this is the look, this is the shirt dress. A lot of tugging in parts, so I'm more than likely gonna have to wear this with tights. Um, the, the material is not the same as the leopard print. The leopard print was like satin. This is a little bit more durable, honestly. I don't know what this is called, but it's nice. It's very soft. It's shiny, but not satin shiny, you know? So I don't know what to call it, but a little rougher, cool material. Um, and if you haven't seen like a, what a Versace pattern is, you won't pretty much understand, but it's very ornate, very gold, lots of design. And you can, you really don't need too much uh, accessories with this because it, honestly, it's an accessory print. Like it's literally your necklace and earrings just all over the shirt, right? You don't really need to do much. Next one. I just want to welcome you all to high tea. I want to thank you all for coming to this glorious occasion. And thank you all for being so patient with me as I tried on five different outfits. Thank you all so much for coming. So I bid you adieu. Thank you. Oh, hi darling, hello. This dress is exactly what I just, this is everything I love about dresses. I used to hate dresses when I was a kid, but this here is honestly what I love about dresses, what I like wearing, and it's what I'm most comfortable in. Something cute and fly, but still very modest, but still very close fitting. All of the perfects, all of the, all of your greatest hits is in this dress, okay? Naturally, for those of you who are constant guests to people's weddings, and or bridal showers. Right here is your dress. I really wouldn't even go anywhere near the color white for a wedding, but this is one of those things where you could kind of like get away with it. It is an off the shoulder number and it, it covers pretty much the whole, you know, top half. It's a high low skirt, so it's, a, it's high in the front, still covers the knee area, very, very long in the back. So nice and flowy. And um, it doesn't hold you too tight, fits perfectly. You just get your size and you're fine. And um, absolutely with some cute heels and a cute purse and move on with it, sis. I would absolutely do a high ponytail or a top bun for this and a nice, cute, soft, pink look, you know, for your face. 
really this makeup right here i probably just do this maybe might be too much but it's fine i am in love with this though this is a really good look and i just i want oh i just want outside to open up i just love this look it's so cute this is pretty much it this is actually the last dress and you guys tell me what you think my favorite piece of all of the dresses that I, I tried on. This right here is my favorite piece. Um, this is the Meet Your Mom dress. This is the church picnic. This is the, you know, the cocktail hour. This is the cocktail party. This is bougie. This is everything. I love it. Blue is my favorite color. So everything about this dress is just perfect. I think it's so cute. But you guys tell me what you think in the comments because I absolutely love it. So obviously, you do too. I mean, no one ever hates the clothes that I try on. <laughs> I'm glad you guys watched this video. Hit the thumbs up if you did. And please make sure to subscribe to my channel. New videos are out every single week on Tuesdays at 8 a.m. So please keep a lookout for all new videos, all new content on my page, The Plush Mommy. And please find me at The Plush Mommy on all my social media platforms. And of course, never forget, spread love, guys. It is the Brooklyn way. And I will see you next week. Bye.